cleanup crews that swept up ashes early Wednesday left behind from a fire that completely destroyed this trailer around 4 p.m. the day before. Mesa Verde resident Eric Hornby was at a nearby golf course at the time. We suddenly noticed the, the black smoke and seeing the general area where it was coming from, we were a bit concerned. Neighbors watched as firefighters battled the flames. We were wondering how far the fire was going to go because of the severe wind that we had. The fire briefly spread to this palm tree. Wayne Saunders took photos as it all so happened. The were all complete inferno inside. He was relieved this propane tank didn't explode. The flames did damage two more homes, including Dorothy Dirksen's. She and her husband are visiting from Canada. We're kind of sad because we just came last Thursday and we were planning to stay for the month and now we don't know whether what, what, what's in store for us. Her fifth wheel suffered exterior damage. The strong smell of smoke still lingers inside. She says this trailer, also damaged, is currently vacant. The owner of this RV told me off camera this situation could have been a lot worse. He was unaware the fire was happening until a neighbor alerted him. Dwayne Keisler says his friend banged on the door of the burning trailer, potentially saving the life of the man inside. He ran right to the trailer and pounded on it. The victim says the Mesa Verde owner is temporarily allowing him to stay in a vacant unit, but is unsure where he'll go after that. Many neighbors I spoke with say one thing is for sure. It's just a piece of metal, bricks and mortar can be replaced, people cannot. In Yuma, I'm Holly Sweet.